You need surgery. Three words you don't want to hear. Hello, I'm Dr. Bernadine Healy, health editor at U.S. News and World Report. Any kind of surgery can be a very scary and daunting experience. But knowing how to navigate the hospital and what to expect at each step may be the best antidote. As part of this year's Best Hospitals Guide, U.S. News visited the Cleveland Clinic to give you an inside look at one of the most common and complex procedures, heart surgery. We start with Dr. Bruce Lytle, chairman of cardiothoracic surgery, who has performed over 12,000 heart operations during his 29 years caring for patients at the clinic. It is my privilege to care for them. Their doctor is working for them. They are not working for their doctor. So you're part of helping them get to the right therapy, whether it's surgery, whether it's not. Absolutely. I mean, about 20 or 25 percent of the people that I see in consultation, we don't end up doing surgery for at least immediately. Uh, and there's some other form of therapy that may be more appropriate for them at that time. They also want to have trust in the captain of the team. But they also want to have trust in the entire team. But they want us to be competent. And, um, you know, that makes people feel a lot more comfortable. Is there anything we can do to encourage patients not to be afraid, to ask questions, not to, to keep them pent up inside? And often it's a source of frustration later. It's really very uncommon that, that patients ask what is called, you know, what they would say, well, gee, this sounds like a stupid question. It's not a stupid question, ever. 